Now let's revisit some of the old questions here and see if they're updated. Where am I from? Sweden. What type of music do I like? Generally all of it, as long as it's not really hardcore like death metal. How did I become a brony? Um, I kept seeing more and more of it on YouTube, so I had to check it out. And it turns, turns out I liked it. That was back in 2011, I think. Late 2011. I am right now 19. 20 so later this year. Yeah, I do. All the way over there. Somewhere. What would I be doing if I did not do YouTube? Well, considering YouTube is primarily a hobby right now, probably the same things, except that I have more time to just play games and watch movies. August 26th. No. No. No! How did I tell my friends that I was a brony? Uh, I asked them if they knew what a brony was, and then I explained what a brony was, and then I said I was one of them. Oh my god, more sim day, that's an old game. Um, I think I've done just about everything there is. There is an alternative ending that's really hard to achieve. I just barely missed out on it, I think, so... Uh, no, probably not, but I hear the developer is making a follow-up, and if he still is, and if he completes it, then you bet your ass I'll play it. Partly because I'm lazy, and partly because I put way too much time into it. <sighs> so once I am editing, it still takes a lot of time. Uh, whatever comes my way. I record with my capture card, with Camtasia, and alternatively using the NVIDIA G4 Shadowplay thing. And, uh... I edit using After Effects. Well, it depends entirely upon how hardcore of a brony you are. If you see being a brony as a lifestyle, then, uh, then yeah, maybe you should tell them, like, Hey, I'm quite into this thing called My Little Pony. Yeah, I know, but this new version is actually very family friendly and I I just appreciate it. The humor resonates with me even if it's tar maybe targeted towards a younger audience. I don't know, it's just who I am, I'm sorry. Something like that. But if it's just a hobby and a TV show that you like to watch occasionally, then uh, you don't need to tell. There's no need to create a hassle. What is your opinion on clappers? Well, just do whatever you want to do, man. Whatever gets you off, as long as it isn't hurting nobody. I don't judge. If you could go into a question, I assume, would you? I would not want to live there because I really like this thing called electricity and internet. But yes, it would be my go-to uh, vacation spot, the same. Well, allow me to repeat myself. Whatever you want to do, man. If you're gay, great. If you're straight, great. If you're something else, trans, whatever, great, man. Just as long as you're happy. Oh, if you had to kill a family to stay alive, oh, damn, we're we're going into some dark territory here. Well, it depends on how. If I have to go all, <sighs> well, <sighs> sorry, Smith family, then uh, I really don't want to die myself. So <laughs> then I probably wouldn't. Then I'd probably just well, <laughs> well, I've had a good life. Goodbye. But if I could choose how I could do it, for example, there is a button and I'm just like, Oh, I'm not seeing, oh no, what's my hand doing? Oh no! Have you committed any crimes? Well, uh, when I was a preteen, you know, 12, 13 years of age, um, I did some minor shoplifting, you know, a bar of chocolate here and there. It only lasted for a month or so before I got caught and promptly scared the shit out of it. Have not broken the law since. Do you have any deep, dark secrets you can share with us? Sometimes, when I drink carbonated soda, I cry. That's not a joke, though. I don't know why I am a little sensitive to carbonated drinks. I'm actually gonna go get get a soda and see if I can demonstrate. Be right back. <coughs> oh yeah, every time I enter a new room I have to sneeze. One root beer is all I got. Let's see here. Notice? No tears. You see this? 
It's just so sad. It's just so many chemicals. I'm sensitive to carbon dioxide, I guess. I don't really know. If you play any console besides PC, what is it? Well, I'm a PlayStation Nation citizen, so I have a PS3 and a PS4. But I am starting to uh, ascend to PC. My favorite game of all time is a tie between two very different games, which is why I can't choose. Minecraft. I'm a creative guy, as you've probably noticed from my, you know, my fanfiction writing and whatnot. So just... You know, oh, it's just my tick. Building my own houses, my own village, and you know, having my own farm and going out mining, getting more resources for my little settlement. Oh, yes, it's just. Ah, I love it. I love it so much. And then, something completely different The Last of Us. Wow, man, just wow, dude. I was like, when I first saw the reveal trailer, it was just like. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's that's it. That's right there. Mm, I gotta get that. So I pre-ordered it right away. Got it on release. Just when I got home, I grabbed the recliner chair and I pushed it over to the TV so I could lie down in it. Just plugged in my PS3, nothing else. Just turn off the lights and I just sat there playing The Last of Us for like seven hours. And then I went to bed. And then the next day I uh, continued, played it for another seven hours, and I beat it right then and there. Two sessions, two days. Sick. Can I play with you sometime? Uh, I'd love to, but I'm not a very uh, multiplayer kind of guy. If you know Cole Moriarty from Kind of Funny Games, I'm a bit like him. Where uh, I like when I, you know, game gaming time is me time. If you know what I mean, where I just kind of shut myself off and sit and play video games. Have you read Metal? I wrote a sequel to it. If you won the lottery, what would you do? The same thing as anyone should do, not tell anyone. It's gonna change the way they people look at you, like your friends and your family. While they may not just straight up walk up to you and say, Hey man, can I borrow 500 bucks? You know, okay, if they may not do that, but you're suddenly gonna be the guy that has the money. When you go to a bar with your friends the next time, suddenly it's all like, Hey Simon, can you just buy us a shot real quick? Hey Simon, can you just please cover the taxi this time? You know, that's how they start, right? They start out by asking for favors and a, a drink. And then it grows and yeah. So just don't tell anyone. Also, it's kind of cool, wouldn't it? I mean, I would probably just live an average life. Except I would have kind of like the cheat code of affording everything I could possibly want. I'm not a very needy guy you know I don't go like I want that and I want that and I want that and I want that if you get a shit ton of money don't just start spending it just live your life as you normally would you know and then have the extra money in case you need it and don't tell anyone for fuck's sake if you were a pony what would be the first thing you do and why well I'm a pegasus so of course I would fly oh, shit that rhymed <laughs> nice <laughs> If any pony, what pony would you want to live or sleep with? Uh, I feel like uh, Rainbow Dash would be a nice roommate. No more comments. If you could hang out with any pony in all of Equestria, which one would it be? Uh, here's the thing, you said in all of Equestria, so I'd probably pick like Princess Celestia. That would be pretty cool, just hanging out with royalty, right? I mean, just imagine like the, the princess is just like strolling the street like in a parade, people are like cheering, and then just you're there, just next to her, like, hey, yeah, cool, yeah, I'm with her, man. We're like super close. Imagine like uh, Princess Celestia enters an important royal meeting, and then a while after, I just like follow after and like jump into the room, and it's like, hey, Princess Celestia, don't just run away from me like that. It's like you're trying to get rid of me. And by the way, I was thinking for tonight, maybe we should rent a movie. Uh, well, what are you guys talking about? Something about Im Im impending doom? It's not important. Anyways, so, but I was wondering if we should get a 3D movie or just a regular movie. What do you think, Princess Estia? What do you mean you don't have time and that I have to go? You're right, 3D is the best. Alright, gotcha. I'm just gonna go to the kitchen and have some more of the uh, royal cake, if that's okay. Yeah, okay, I'll see. I'll see you in a bit. Oh, it's okay, so I've been sitting here for like half an hour now, it's uh, time to end this, but not before addressing one more question, and that is... Of course I will. I'm not at all like PewDiePie!